Hi and um, welcome uh, to my little uh, video about um, the Midland uh, uh, 8001 XT. Well, I don't going to have a lot of um, information about how good this one is and uh, what's uh, not good with it. Uh, well, because this is not even mine. I got it today. I just checking it. A friend of mine had some problems, and um, well, the problem is solved, and uh, now it's been a bit modified. That's it's what I'm going to show you uh, how to modify the um, uh, so you can have uh, more channels. Uh, and now it's already modified. That means when I press, uh, as you see right now, and when I press noise planker, you see it changed from uh, 235 uh, to 245. That's the 10 plus uh, in Hertz. When the radio is uh, standard, you don't have that uh, option. Uh, now let's go to E and 11. And check the frequency. You see now it's not on the triple. No, it's not uh, strange. Well, now uh, you see that uh, you could not be on the triple when it's original uh, and, and unmodified very stupid thing i think uh, i don't uh, well i guess it's because it's not imported uh, or so or export and whatever uh, it's strange that uh, or one jumper is all you need to change and I will show you how to do that. Uh, first off, I will turn the power off. Of course. Don't want to toast my friend's uh, radio. It's brand new. Almost. Um, yeah, well, it's brand new. Uh, crazy friend I have. Trust me with the radio. <laughs> it's his problem. Not mine. Could be my problem though if I break it. Uh, now, well, I'm strong when putting in but not taking out the antenna. Strange. So, turn the radio. Don't do the mistake to open it uh, on the top side. Because, well, you don't want to see a backside of the uh, oh, let's say motherboard. Uh, I have a pre opened this one, uh, just have to. It's the two uh, screws there uh, on this side, two on the other side, and one in the back. Just so you know. Now I'm working one hand here, so not that uh, simple as task. Well, now I'm going to show you. The first I would show you is where to locate the jumper for for the mod to change uh, to add the ten plus. I would get some better lightning hopefully at least well uh, I guess you can see uh, if you look this is the front it's upside down this is the, the channel selector frequency selector now it's on a little circuit board on that circuit board you got a jumper now uh, it's hard to see it's light, you know, shadows and things. Uh, it jump. Oh, I moved the light a bit. So, 
It's a jumper behind this cable there. You can see it where I point now. Perhaps you can see that jumper. Uh, just uh, change it's free. It's a free pin jumper. It's connected on the two. Take uh, uh, something and move that. I don't know. Uh, lost the word for it. Uh, in Swedish, it's a tongue. Now we have learned that. And uh, move that jumper one step from uh, left side to right side. Easy to do uh, and um, gives you uh, uh, the 10 plus ability on the radio. But it's not only that I will show you. I will uh, show you how to modify uh, the a little bit in power. Uh, uh, original it's the 12 uh, whiskeys on the SSP and uh, the 5 on the AM FM. Well, you can at least have a 20 on um, all bands. Yeah, all bands, all, all uh, well, all bands, uh, AM, FM, and SSB. Uh, easily done. I would show you, try to, at least. Uh, it's uh, all about jumpers, even here. It's uh, three jumpers you have to open or close. Uh, this one, original, it's closed. Open it. I have just moved the jumper connector so it is uh, still there. But this jumper is opened up. Uh, on this one, I hope you can see, uh, on this one, there are uh, a jumper connector, originally. Take then that one off and move that one to the jumper next to this cable use that use that uh, connector on this one then you have 30 watt extra i repeat uh, this one is closed when you in the original just uh, move that so it's open uh, i would suggest to put it on the one of the pins uh, so it uh, you don't lose it or something and then take this one off uh, put that one on this one now uh, there could be a problem uh, you can modify this one even more uh, you can modify it, uh, the power even more. This will give you around 20 watts. Uh, you can also modify it even more. But uh, that will also uh, give you some uh, more, dist uh, I don't know the word now, um, distortion. Uh, so I suggest uh, 20 watt is uh, quite okay for this radio uh, to work on uh, and uh, remember 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 this is uh, important to remember if you some uh, you modify this radio and you get it to 20 watts and then you buy yourself a foot warmer with a hundred whiskey or so. Don't forget to change this back so you don't dis uh, destroy your amplifier um, because they are often very, very, very rarely made for input less than original so there are really really big chance that you toast your input on the, your foot warmer as i uh, like to call them
Well, I hope uh, this uh, will um, help you a little. Now I will uh, put it together and um, have some DX. And I say bye, bye, bye.